Hi, this is Amy Rieselman. I am a practitioner of holistic medicine specializing in acupuncture and Chinese herbal medicine. I am in Lyle, right on Route 53, north of Ogden, at North Star Integrated Health and Physical Medicine Center. And today I want to explain to you, how does acupuncture work? How can it help you? So one way to think about this is imagine a rubber band wrapped tightly around your finger. What's going to happen? It's going to start turning red. It's going to start turning purple. It's going to get kind of uncomfortable. Why? Because there's a blockage there. The blood can't flow through properly. This is similar to what is happening in your body when you get symptoms. Symptoms are a sign that there is a blockage in your energy meridians. And what acupuncture does is it can we detect where those blockages are and how to remove the blockages so that your body's natural flow of energy, including nerve supply, blood supply, fluid supply, um, all of that can circulate properly and ensure that all of your cells are fed and nourished properly. So acupuncture is kind of like taking that rubber band off. If you leave that rubber band on and you just exercise and you work out and you eat really healthy, you try and get lots of sleep, you try and do everything right, you're still going to have that blockage. It doesn't always get removed when you um, make healthy lifestyle choices, although healthy lifestyle choices are important. Um, so what you need to do is get that rubber band removed, which is acupuncture removing those energetic blockages deep inside the body. That's one way to think about it. Another way to think about it is, say you have a garden hose, and you know when it gets kinked up, you've got the water flowing from the spigot, through the hose but nothing's coming out the other end that's like an energy meridian with a blockage in it and this does happen in the body um, and it's not something that can be detected really with MRIs or CAT scans or things like that these are things that we detect in Chinese medicine so uh, we find where those kinks are and we have ways using acupuncture needles and other things to get those blockages removed so I hope this has been helpful. I hope you understand a little bit more about Chinese medicine and acupuncture. And if you have any other questions, I'd love to hear from you. Amy at amyrieselman.com. Visit my website, Amy Rieselman, that's A-M-Y-R-I-E-S-E-L-M-A-N.com, which is probably where you found this video. Um, and I hope to hear from you soon. Thanks.